Good day. The topic for today is the continuation for part 2 of Lambda. Again, Lambda. Lambda controller is to prevent injection for more fuel in the combustion chamber. Means this is controlling the relation between fuel index and charge air pressure. This is the regulating arm. The regulating at the at the end of that regulating arm which is installed the pneumatic uh, the taco or pickup for jet assist at the top that is the arm for the cylinder of lambda controller and this is the taco for the RPM of the engine okay at the end of that regulating arm where the taco installed for jet assist as you can see there is a wire Below that is the taco or pick up for jet assist. That is the regulating for the fuel. Uh, that is the fuel rack regulating for the index or for our fuel index. That is our fuel rack. And this is the regulating arm which is connected to our fuel rack. At this side, this is the air system connected going to our solenoid for our jet assist going to turbocharger. That solenoid activates 10 seconds. After that, 10 seconds if the fuel index and the relation with the charge air pressure is not satisfied this will give a alarm because this solenoid continues open and the number two purpose is for lambda is stop valve who activates the stop valve this this unit this gives signal to the lambda this is the overspeed device the overspeed device there is a connected below the 5 to 2 a uh, 3 to 2 way pneumatic valve if the overspeed activates that gives air to lambda to stop the engine The overspeed device is equipped with limit switch. Limit switch is act as a alarm, send signal alarm to our alarm panel. But the overspeed 3 to 2 way valve sends signal going to this lambda and lambda pushes the fuel rack to stop all fuels. Okay, let's start the generator locally during starting the generator it gives a load increase momentary load increase in the regulating device it increases the index on the fuel rack including the regulator and touch the regulator arm to the piston arm which activates the pickup and then pickup activates also the solenoid and turns the jet jet solenoid activated the turbocharger accelerates increase the charge air pressure which the piston of the lambda moves backward okay recap the purpose of the lambda 
there is a two purpose of lambda is to prevent injection for more fuel in the combustion chamber and controlling the relation between fuel index and the charge air pressure next uh, fuel lambda acts as a stop cylinder if the overspeed activates okay that is the two purpose of lambda thank you for watching i hope you get some idea from this video and don't forget like share and subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell for more updates